there's someone who's written a story here, it's a long one. Um, it says, I'm, in, I'm a newly born again Christian and would like to share my story of salvation with you. I was born in West Philadelphia and also raised there. I spent most of my days playing basketball on the playground, but also chilling out and relaxing. But then one day, a couple of guys who were up to no good started making trouble in my living area. I ended up getting into a fight, which terrified my mother. As a result, she sent me away from West Philadelphia to the most peaceful area of Bel Air. Oh, okay. Fresh. <laughs> okay. And I think, yeah, I think there's some, there's some Mongolians on the system. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, you know what? Let me take this caller. Joyce from. Um, uh, my inspiration in life is a man I met in Nigeria called Ben Kenobi. He taught me so much about the force that spirituality has. It can be used for good and it can be used for bad. Mm -hmm. There is a light and a dark to everything. It's up to us to make sure that the light side of things outweighs the dark side. But in the kingdom of God, it's all about light. No darkness at all. So, but people go over and get powers from the enemy. Mm -hmm. And that's darkness, really. I helped him spread his message as best as I could for summer. For the summer, I was there. But one man with a particularly sharp tongue attacked his beliefs one day and he disappeared shortly after. He believed the midichlorians controlled all of us and created all of us. He didn't think that the force of spirituality and midichlorians went hand in hand. Ben taught me that we must always try to live in harmony with all other forces of the universe. I don't think that is biblical because you can't live in harmony with, harmony with other forces that are contrary to the power of God. It's, you, you, you can't. Always, the power of God, according to the Bible, is superior to any other power. Any other power, so and that all other powers must bow to the power of God, as illustrated in the Bible. So I think you have to go check your doctrine and your thing well. You know, it, it doesn't it doesn't look sound to me. I got to, you know, I have to tell you that you know sincerely from bottom bottom of my heart. You know, it doesn't sound right. You can't live in harmony harmony with other forces. It's only one force that's supreme and is the power of God according to the Bible. Then, with the power of God, you take charge of the whole thing, really. Um, in, in response to the previous email, uh, there's a strong... No problem. I, I just skimmed that one. I just quickly go through some of these emails. So many emails here tonight. Um. <laughs> the devil is a bad devil. <laughs> 